Hi, I'm Naoki Sagato from Osaka University. And I'm talking about BioRuby. BioRuby is a bioinformatics software library and tools writing in the Ruby programming language. So I'm very exciting uh, participating in Hackathon in Matsue Ruby City. So um, BioRuby is open source free software and currently uh, 1.5.2 uh, and this is the website uh, and and we are developing BioRuby for uh, over uh, nearly uh, over 18 years so and, and there are many contributors uh, over 30 people have been involved in core development and many, we, we have many pull requests. Uh, thank you for contributors. And currently, uh, there are uh, over 200 files and uh, over, uh, over 35,000 lines. Uh, this is a very large library. And there are many functions in BioRuby, uh, including basic sequence data and uh, the data format parsers and uh, tools, uh, tools parser and uh, supporting libraries and web API and IO clients. So and in recently, uh, we developed BioGem. Uh, BioGem is a uh, uh, Ruby package for biology. And recently, we released uh, new functions as BioGem. So there are over 100 packages are now available. And during this hackathon, uh, I'd like to split by Ruby core package into several gen packages uh, it, to clarify what is provided and uh, to keep the code simple to reduce maintenance cost. And uh, I'd like to remove all the unmaintained code. And we we have a lot of things to refactoring and improvements. And, and I'd like to release new version during the hackathon. And there are many documentation. But, uh, if you are interested, please join us. And in addition, uh, I'm, I'm also participated in SciRuby and the local community, SciRuby JP. Uh, many uh, scientific projects are ongoing in Ruby. And there are Ruby new more uh, for uh, like uh, NumPy, uh, in dimensional numeric array, and uh, red data tools uh, providing data processing tool for Ruby. And there are uh, red China, uh, Coding a deep learning framework on Python. And, and for cross language approach, uh, there, is, there is PyCall called Python functions from uh, Ruby. And Green Ruby called R interpreter from Ruby. So I like to use, utilize these uh, library and libraries more. So, uh, thank you. Thank you.